Hi guys and welcome back to my vlog. This week's vlog is a pack and prep for Africa and every time I go on stay I only use one bag so I'm gonna show you how I fit my whole life into one checked luggage. Now this vlog is gonna be all over the place because I'm at my parents house now and tomorrow I'll be at my boyfriend's packing the majority of my stuff but I wanted to show you a few of my must-haves before I put them into my luggage. I'm about to run to my salon and eyebrow appointment so I'll put those clips in now and then we can get back to packing. <laughs> I haven't gotten my brows done in, I wanna say years. They're looking rough. I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm also gonna do my upper lip. So we'll come back with the results. Hopefully I'm not crying. Cause if they fuck up my eyebrows, I will cry. It kind of burns, but I think they look good. I don't know, we'll see. They're not too aggressive, but I think that's okay cause I like the soap brows anyway. Okay. Now I always start off with shoes. These aren't the only shoes I'm bringing, but these are the categories I'm bringing. Tennis shoes, slippers, and heels. I usually bring three heels, three tennis shoes, and two slippers. For pants, I try and bring three of everything. So three leggings, three sweatpants, and three jeans, which I haven't packed yet. For sweats, I'm gonna do one of every color, black, gray, and cream. These shirts are like my fun shirts. I haven't packed any of my summer dresses yet because they're all at Tyler's, but they'll go together in my luggage. For tops, I try and bring five basic white and five basic black. Of course, I'll have a shitload more of swimsuits that I need to get. I try not to bring too many sweatshirts just because it takes up so much space and it'll be summer there, so I don't really need any. These are all my toiletry bags. This one is my makeup, but all three of them are definitely necessities. I bring lots of chargers, my three books, the book I'm reading, my journal, and my calendar. And then I also bring shampoo and conditioner just because. <laughs> a little package from 4am skincare we have a rest serum i typically have really dry skin so i love a good serum it feels nice now let's see if it breaks me out <laughs> sinclair we are so excited for you to try our 4am lineup sap and jess the 4am founders so cute what i read about them in this little case is eye patches but they're reusable They're obviously a lot harder of a material than they usually are. Apply existing serum or cream to the under eye area and allow it to get slightly tacky. Place mask on top and let it sit for 10 to 20 minutes. After using, wash with water. Keep in the fridge for extra depuff. Reusable up to one year. Oh my God, this is perfect for my trip. I'm so excited. Thank you so much. Can't wait to use these and I will keep you guys posted with the results. I don't think I'll cry. Bye mama. Bye. <laughs> Try not to cry. <laughs> Love you. Bye dad. Love you. Wish me luck. Good luck. <laughs> I'm back at Tyler's. We're here doing the other half of my suitcase. We went to the gym this morning, which felt so good because I haven't been into a sauna in months. If you know me, you know I love the sauna. It was also good to get my body moving because it's snowing here and we haven't been doing anything outside. So that was definitely a necessity before I get on a 24 hour flight. <laughs> Moving on to the rest of my suitcase. Right now, I'm about to go through my fun dresses, my fun cover-ups. This is stuff I'm gonna wear out to lunch, dinner, on a bow, at the beach, etc. First is this little free people. I'm obsessed with this one. This is my color. <laughs> or my favorite color. I don't know if it's my color. <laughs> this dress is also free people. It's great for castings. This goes around my neck and this sits right under my boobs. Super short, but super cute. Next, I have this BB dress. I love this color so much, as you can tell. <laughs> okay, next is this Love Shack Fancy light pink and it's got a pleated skirt. I love a pleated skirt. The last dress before we move to cover-ups is this little dress. I wore this in France and at Coachella two years ago, so it's definitely had its moment, but I'm still gonna bring it just in case. The brand is My Michelle. Moving on to cover-ups, I have this light purple. This is like a jumpsuit. It's so cute. There's a big gap at the waist. I got this in a boutique in Ibiza. <laughs> But the brand is called Hot and Delicious. Another super cute purple color. I was gonna wear this to Coachella and then it came in the mail and I was like, damn, this is really see-through. But I think it would be super cute with like a black or white bikini. Now this one I actually got in Birmingham, Michigan. Also super cute with a black or white, even yellow bikini. It gets big at the arms, which is so cute. If I can figure out the right way. 
It's basically just like a little mini dress, but fishnet. And for jeans specifically on this trip, I'm doing one pair of light wash just because it's going to be so fucking hot. And then I've got these two jean skirts. This one's from Pink and this one is from Aeropostale. I'll always bring a black bikini for digitals. Here's some more bikinis I'm going to bring. This one is black doe. And this one is solid and striped like a halter top, which is my favorite. I'm not very athletic, but there's a bunch of mountains there and I've seen a bunch of beautiful photos. So I definitely want to try and start hiking. I'm sure I'll take you guys on that journey too. So stay tuned. But that's about it for my wardrobe. We have to run to Sephora really quickly to grab a few products that I ran out of or that I'm going to need for my trip. That's the bum bum cream. Tyler also just dropped me off at the gas station so I can get some airport snacks. You guys want to know what my airport snack is? It's a classic. Oh my God, they probably aren't going to have it. Bad news, gas station didn't have the... Did you go to the other night? But do you think they'll have it? I wanted the green Pringles. Anyways, the gas station we were attached to had a Dunkin' and I knew that the Starbucks drinks were out November 2nd, but I didn't know that the Dunkin' Christmas drinks were out. So we're definitely getting a cookie butter cold brew. Ah, I'm so excited. I love Christmas. We watched the best movie I've seen last night in months. Yeah. Harold and Kumar Escape from Guantanamo Bay. It's like Pineapple Express Core. It's so good. I downloaded like 50 movies. You guys want to see what I downloaded? 13 Going on 30, Falling for Christmas, Love Hard, Runaway Bride, Love Actually, My Best Friend's Wedding, Sex in the City, Wait, Forgetting four, four. Sarah Marshall. Have you ever had this, babe? Uh, like Tyler that. hates cold brew, which is such an L. Well, he hates all coffee. It's solid as well. I know, it's good. Tyler pulled over to another gas station. So hopefully this has my goodies. Thank you. I made it through security. It was super easy. I'm actually having really good luck today. Everyone's been super nice. Travel days for me are usually super stressful. So I'm loving this energy. A little bit more about what I'm going to do when I get there. I'm actually living with a host family this time around. I usually live in Model House. I did host family. Last time I went on stay in Germany and I loved it. So I'm gonna do it this time. But my best friend Ashley is living there in another model house like 10 minutes down the street. So I'm sure we'll be with each other a bunch. Now I wanna show you guys everything I keep in my carry-on. I'm very selective about what I keep in here just because I don't wanna lug it around. I don't need it. First things first, my passport, my keys. I always bring my keys. This has about five or six different countries of houses keys on it. I keep a brush in here always. I've got my airport snacks. I used to not mind airport food, but now every time I get like a whiff of airport pasta or meatloaf. <sighs> my wallet, my light, <laughs> my iPad. And these are my glasses. I should get a harder case. I don't know if a lot of people know that, that I actually wear contacts 24 seven. I have the worst vision of everyone I've ever known in my life. Okay guys, I finished my first flight. I don't know if I told you that my layover was in Atlanta. I've got a few hours before I take off for Cape Town. So I'm about to go grab a snack at Starbucks, but the flight was good. I was sandwiched in between two grown men, but that's how it happens every time. So I've learned to deal with it. Okay guys, I just got through passport claim. I mean passport control, now I'm at baggage claim and I literally forgot what my bag looks like. <sighs> wow. <laughs> All right guys, I've got my driver. This is so cute, I'm so excited. Of course this is a ladies bag. So heavy. Yeah. I'm here. Okay, it looks nice. All right guys. I made it. I'm gonna make a whole separate video of my first week here where I'll give you a tour of the house and kind of explain a little bit more about what I'm gonna be doing here and maybe take you to a few castings. So keep an eye open for that vlog, but I'm so excited. I can't believe we made it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week.